Dancing Studio here. Welcome to the program. <laughs> Is it really? I mean, the team have told me uh, we're preparing for tonight that you struggle with confidence at times. Is that yeah, true? of course. Why? Why? Well, I think I, I don't know anyone that doesn't struggle with confidence on, on most days. Um, but, I, you know, I've been judged on my looks since I was 15. Mm. I started modelling at 15. And I think... You know, I've never been a size zero. I've always wanted to stick up for the feminine form mm. and um, really champion being true to yourself and um, and feeling empowered in that. But you then, need some confidence to do that. Well, well, you must have some confidence <laughs> to do it. in in, in an industry run by uh, where it's merely stick insects that are going yeah. up and down. That shows great confidence but to then, me. But then you're constantly compared to that. And I think nowadays mm. with social media, you're constantly faced with so image after image of mm. comparisons and looking outside of yourself. And, and I think, yeah, it's, it's definitely something I have to work on every day. Do you, uh, do you think there's lots of people who um, seem outwardly confident? But actually, they're, they're not. Inside, of they are a <laughs> bag of nerves. <laughs> yeah, of course. I think, actually, usually the most confident people, seemingly confident people, mm. are, in fact, the, well, narcissists are the most insecure ones of the lot, right? Indeed. <laughs> Definitely <laughs> are. <laughs> Says, says our favourite narcissist. <laughs> so who was that time? <laughs> so anybody Sorry, you were talking I'm about keep there. that inside. I just... Um, <laughs> I was surprised. I, I, I think she may have... It was just a joke. I'd be really surprised. Someone like Emma Thompson, mm. educated, intelligent, yeah. wonderful actress, uh, saying that she couldn't go to L.A. because why would she even care? <laughs> You know, but, but it's because it, she is so much more than just her appearance. Exactly. Of course, I mean, her appearance is great, but so is everything else. But she's an incredible actress, yeah. as you said, writer, producer. But then it comes back to the way that she looks. Women are always judged more for their appearance yeah. than men are. And that's, that's still true shame. today, as we saw from the front page of the yeah, Daily Mail yeah. uh, there as well. Do you think a, a low confidence, does it stop, stop you from doing things? I mean, in your case, it seems to me to, it's to boost you on to, yeah, totally. to, to, I have to, to do it. I have to use that as fuel, for sure. I mean, you know, taking part in Strictly, I would have never been able to do that That's if confidence. I let my... Well, it was a complete lack of confidence. Or, or foolhardy. <laughs> it was, you know, I've never been through such bone-shaking terror as I was on, on the show. But then it gave me something, and I learned so much about myself, and actually learned I love performing, and and just loved building mm. that confidence. It was very special. Are you confident, Liz? I think I'm pretty confident. I would agree. So you um, should be. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not overconfident either, which well, is important. I, I think I was, you know, I was very lucky in how I was brought up that they, my mum and dad, always said, kind of, go for it, and if mm. it goes wrong, we still love you yeah, and it doesn't matter exactly. and I, that gave me confidence obviously i had lots of other advantages but that sense if you yeah. try and you don't succeed yeah. pick yourself up go and again we love else. you we're here for you and that's really matters are you confident michael i think on the whole i am but i think it is ephemeral by which i mean that any day it can desert you mm. Mm. you can really you true. you can never be sure that it will be there when you mm. when you need it and it's not even predictable the circumstances that will make it disappear and I must say, if there were one gift I could give to someone, it would be confidence, because mm. it makes all the difference. Mm. That, yeah. that self-belief, that, that ability to go out and do it, mm. um, just makes all the difference. It does, no matter what you're doing. No, no matter, matter what. what. what uh, Dizzy, what are you doing? What am I doing? Well, I'm taking myself out of my comfort zone at the moment and yeah. um, for the first time properly in my career actually being more than just a 2D image <laughs> and, and coming on and doing terrifying things like coming and chatting to all of you. Oh, this incredible is a piece of cake. <laughs> well, we're glad you came on tonight. Yeah, me too. Good Thanks to so. see you. Thank you. Daisy.